All right, guys, welcome back. Main stage 2021. You already know what it is. We're playing our way through. Losers, actually, now we're going to look. So these players' backs against the wall. We're going to see what they can come up here in the clutch situation. Still trying to fight for one of those uh, very, very valuable summit spots, Pony. Like we were just talking about, I mean, the summit spots are something that this event can offer that very few others can. Yeah. Right? And yeah. I, I think because of that, I, all the players have a little bit more fire in their hearts. Summit, just such a prestiged event. Uh, particularly for Ultimate, right? Because, I mean, like, you know, obviously it's a huge deal for Melee, but for Ultimate, it's a chance for you to really create your own story now. Yep. This is your opportunity in the in the sort of early stages, even still, of the game to really cement your legacy and uh, get yourself up there. So we'll see how these players try to make their path. MVD currently in losers after losing to Jake, uh, the Sna uh, Steve player. Actually, that was on the other stream on the side. Yep. Had a tough set, but seems like he's going to be going up against <laughs> Ven here, you who just ben. popped in yeah, <laughs> at the very end. Zelda player extraordinaire from Vegas, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, man. So it's going to be Zelda. Like we said, it's going to be Zelda against it. <laughs> just a good Whose one. hand is you that? Guys are, that was MBD. You guys are losers. Come on. <laughs> Tighten it up. Let's go. Yeah, you guys got to be serious, bro. This uh, is important. They're having fun, which I also respect, to be honest with you. But either way, we set a lot on the line here. You don't want to lose yet. Drop out of the bracket before you can get to some serious business here. Ben against MVD. We're going to see a lot of this gameplay, Coney, right here. Sit back just a little bit. Seems like this is going to be, and, and this is just theory crafting, because Lord knows I've perhaps seen three Zeldas in my history of this game. Yeah. Uh, not on Elite Smash. Not on, oh, God, no. Not yeah. on Elite Smash. I've seen billions and zillions, and they all live in the same house. <laughs> Um, Share Ven, the same controller, man. Right, yeah. Ven in particular, though, uh, you know, obviously very astute. Probably the top Zelda player there is. Uh, but this seems very difficult for Zelda. A character who has to be very precise in how she sort of comes in. Her aerials aren't really things Ooh. that you can just spam like crazy. It seems difficult to overwhelm Snake with her speed. Uh, also, Zelda isn't really a run-up and dash grab type, which is, you know, sometimes what Snake can suffer from. Ooh. Seems to be doing pretty well right now, though. Didn't pull the trigger on the up hit of the up B. Just wanted to play it safe, put his feet on the ground. Sitting back there. Oh, nice. And now it's MVD approaching. You see him come in all the way with the back air. <laughs> Looking for the Nikita. Can't find it, though. Here comes Ben now. Got to get off this platform. Setting up the Knight, too. It's going to be a big... We've seen how far, like, MVD faces backwards with Grenade while he's holding it to approach right. with the Knight so the, the explosion's closer to Zelda, which is really smart. Here we go, though. Pressure. Just holding shield. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Through the bottom. Very nice shot by Ven there. That was huge shield pressure while he's off stage, but stomping on with the down air. Coney, retaliation from MVD. Stocks are flying. I hate that move. Down air? When does Snake ever do that? That's not sneaky That's, at all. See that. That's Metal Gear Solid 2, man. No, he doesn't. Yeah, he I does. played that game. Oh, well, which one didn't you play? <laughs> it's from that one. Twin Snakes? <laughs> yeah, yeah, there no. it is. Yeah. That's actually called the Twin Snake. Uh, ah, yeah. okay. Even mm -hmm. though there are four of them. Okay. Well, well yeah. it's two feet. So. And you call them Twin Snakes despite the fact that there's obviously four. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All go. right. He has the C4 on him. Let's see if MVD uh, goes Joker mode on this. Okay, no. He's going to... It's on her. He doesn't pop it, though. Is the Nikita out? Wait. Zelda has a lovely <laughs> new headpiece. Oh my okay, god, dude. Go. What yeah. a shield. That was so quick. He threw it up almost instantly. And I think, I can't tell. I, I want to see if he's listening to the sound or not because it, it helps a lot in that reaction. But either way, very nice job by Ven holding onto the stock. But now he's got to fight back against Snake. Done a good job of putting the pressure on, honestly. Like, really, really good shield pressure, both with projectiles and aerials from Ven so far. Kind of an underrated part of Zelda's kit is the shield pressure she could put out yep. in the right spot. I mean, we saw it just, uh, that thing on the left side was wow. so sick. And you see there. Then just tracking MVD. That's really where Snake is most vulnerable, is in the air, uh, pretty much anywhere on screen. Zelda seems to be able to skip the interaction of, like, precisely hitting him while he holds a grenade, because you just pop that up air. You don't care Ooh. how you blow up. Yeah, man. And then we're seeing another, again, really, really quick stock taken from MVD. He's not letting the lead get out of control here, as it can against Zelda, to be honest. Especially someone like Ben, right, knows the matchup and the character so well, can just keep Snake out. But so far, it's been dead even, to be honest, Coney. Really impressive for both players so far. Yeah, I mean, Ven's ability to keep up has been very... Oh, my God. You can see it there, trying to get that grab, having the right spot. Ven has been just really dictating the, the pace of the match in a lot of ways. It seems like Ven keeps getting these kills, and then MVD will immediately get the kill after. But if that pace continues, obviously, mm -hmm. Ven going to go up in this game. Right, yeah. It's who, all comes down to, obviously, who takes his last stock. That's the key thing here. Knight coming out strong, too. Ven setting up a bit of a wall here. Knight's, oh, my God, he blew it up, too. 
Hitting Zelda will disarm that knight, so a very nice job by MVD. Timing the explosions is going to be huge here. It's not just throwing the grenades. How long do you cook them? When do you toss them? What angle? All that stuff, man, needs to come into play. This is just really impressive play Whoa. from Ven, like I said, because it does feel like Zelda can't really overwhelm Snake. You just have to play the same game he's playing, but just sort of find his pockets where he's open. And it seems yeah. like Sven is able to do that so well here. For sure. Not getting too close there for the Nair. Would have done big damage. Maybe even killed, honestly. 126 Rage is big on Snake. Up till we'll kill. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No question. You see Ven trying to play from a distance, not letting that be. Oh, what? Oh, what? man. Another uh, underrated part of Zelda's kit is that forward air out of shield. Like, it's right. really quick. Honestly, and the sweet spot obviously does so much damage and knockback. Really nice shot by Ben. Recognition looked like just a bit of misinput from MVD. So Had to have been. Hate to see that. Well, either that or it was the boldest option. I've seen it in a minute. You know what I mean? In, again, in real life, that would be a great option. Rocket <laughs> launcher. You pull out a rocket you, you launcher. run up to me, I pull out a rocket launcher. Guess who wins <laughs> that? Not you. Well, I I thought he was just gonna like get a grab or something, but the yeah. fact that he yeah. popped out that uh that fire, well yeah. done. And MVD, I don't know if you saw it, but he sort of like hit his leg. He looked really frustrated, and he can't hold on to that emotion too much because it really is a bad spot to be in against Zelda, who's a character that really lives off frustrating you, off really picking apart your defense. Oof. These up airs from Ven have been so good too. Taking, so good. taking stock and then also spacing around. When Snake's above you, holding the grenade a little high, using it to detonate them and do more shield damage or shield poking, it's so good, man. Up air oh. again, uh-huh. He's looking, man. He's on the hunt for these up airs and keeping the fair fresh too. That's another thing I really like about him using that move so much. Oh, tries to pop it. What's the punish? We got a down throw. Oh, just normal get up, but we're oh, going to go through it again. The Brawl Snake, man, he's doing the tech chases. He's yep. doing it again, yep. I like the fact that when you push people, they just go further to the ledge. Yeah. By the way, Ven picked normal get up three times in a row. Is that what happened? It was twice, I think. Either way, what a bold young man. Yeah. Trying to Sometimes it's like a, like a gut check, you know what I mean? Sure. Oh, nice! Oh right my into God. the night. The alley-oop, dude. That picture of Dwayne Wade and uh, LeBron, you know what I mean? But Zelda yeah. in the night, yep, clean up till again, dude. Again. MVD, I'm telling you, man, you can't get a lead on this man in this set, Ben. Yeah, it feels like every time Ven has some stock lead or oh my God. some kind of opportunity, MVD just closes out Woo. right away. But still, Ven is Woo. just Woo. ahead. Oh, he's got the apron on, he's cooking right now. This is crazy. And again, MVD just can't get too frustrated. We saw him do it before, has the C4 on him. Then gonna try to do what he can to. Sort of shift it. There he goes on the ground. Trying to create some space for himself with the Din's fire. Trying to get out of the sledge. Get away from MBD. Take your time. Don't push it. Okay, nice. Another back air, man. MBD's had a lot of success with that move so far, too, in the set. Couple explosions, though. Keeping Ben in the disadvantage. Oh, I like the C4 there. Trying to catch like a spot dodge or something like that. Just land on him, but nothing really happening there. But you're right. I mean, the back air is really just the MVD special. Like, yeah, he yeah. loves to land with it, loves to get out of disadvantage, loves to throw out the aerials as much as nice. he can. The up tilt should do it, but he doesn't pull the trigger. Nice. That time he rolled away. No neutral get up that time. Certainly we've been caught by MVD. Good right. mix up there by Ben. Now he's on the hunt here. Of course, looking for the up air. Of course. Of course, yeah. Let's talk about the signature aerials from these players. Oh, get out. <laughs> Does she control it now? <laughs> she just drives it into him. Where is it? <laughs> uh, Well, I think maybe... An audience member caught a stray, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. All right, Zelda, come on. It's going to go hit a satellite. <laughs> 146 here. Who's going to land this next kill? I mean, it, historically, it has been Ven getting the KO and then MVD killing right after. Yep. Let's well, see. Up throw well. will do it. All right, here comes up tilt. Here we go. Well, hold on. Z Does Ven get 1%? Going through the prediction th in the chat. <laughs> Put up a poll. Yeah, 1% uh, total. Nice job oh. going over the ledge that time, too, with the up beat to, to uh, disarm the uh, the Nikita. Oh, here we go. Okay, he's got some damage. Oh, Jeez. he gets the boom kick, man. It's coming in strong. So, okay, all right. That was still pretty quick, though. Like, in terms of timing, it was quick. He's still 841, and now more. Has, getting the tech chase. Couldn't find it, though, just off the mark with that aerial. Oh, man, 64 here. MVD just sort of looks... Uh a little yeah. lost against Zelda. I mean, it's a weird matchup for any character, let alone one who wants to really dictate the pace of the match as much as Snake does. But between the Phantom, between her uh, reversals or the, the counter with the love, it just feels like Ven is just ready for this. I didn't know what you meant. You said the I know, my counter bad, my bad. with, with you the You know what love. I mean? The narrow. It was like, a, it was like a translation didn't work. You know what I mean? It's like <laughs> with the love. It's like not. <laughs> <laughs> like the patch notes? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh my nice. God! Did he kill? Yeah, oh yeah. Oh, not no, yet. Oh wow! He got a little charge on that too. Really close. 
go. Nikita's Pressure now from MVG. Down, man. yeah. Wow. He's a long that Yeah, that, that was, he was here for a while. Oh, oh, he didn't get it, though. First hit in air, no follow-up. C4 coming out strong, setting up the pressure of the ledge. Ven just skirting by it, though. He was ready to go. Oh! Thought that might be up air. Ven not letting it rip, just going to chill for a little bit. He wants oh. to find an aerial. Ven needs to find... Wait, is that it? No. Dude, he did a run-up grab against Snake at death percentage. Ven is playing wild right now. Oh, 125 here. MVD has wrestled back control of this game. <laughs> the love. Joining the other one. Yep. <laughs> oh! Right, yeah, that's going to do it there for sure. Go. Yeah. Nice shot by MVD, closing that one out, clutch stuff. But like you said, it really has been back and forth in terms of stocks being taken. Ben takes one, then MVD almost immediately takes one right back. That time going in the favor of MVD, taking down game two. Moving to a game three situation, Coney. Again, another game three. Yeah, it's been Hell all yeah, game man. threes across the board. Honestly, if you asked me 45 seconds before the end of that game, I would have told you Ven had yeah. it locked in. But it feels like MVD figured something out, just sort of uh, put all the pieces together against Ven. And now we're going to game three. It is Ven's counter pick. And part of me is wondering, what does Zelda pick here? You know, what's the uh, what's the play? I think, if I had to guess, I was going to say, we're probably PS2 just running it back, short. honestly. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like we said, it is so even. Like, it's just going to come down to a couple key decisions here if they nope. both play well. Nice. I love that. <laughs> the love. Yeah. Whatever it is. <laughs> Neutral B, though, when it, it does flip the grenades, you know what I mean? Like, right. you're able to, you know, snag them or whatever. Really nice. But here we also go. Also good against Nikita off, off, off stage. I yeah. mean, Ben is just using all of Zelda's oh. tools so well. Uh-huh. Definitely going to be important. Any projectile, obviously, Zelda's going to want to use neutral B. Just helps out. Okay. Maybe getting a little bit too eager, though. Keeps yeah. going for it, and MVD is just waiting. Getting the shield. I love these uh, grabs from MVD. A lot more grabbing happening here. Yeah. MVD off to an amazing start. Oh, my God. And the up tilt is certainly going to do it off the top. Now it's Ben's turn to respond, Coney. Tables have turned. This is, if I'm not mistaken, the first time uh, MVD has taken the first stock in a game. So now is his opportunity. I mean, this is what MVD wants, right? He wants Ven to have to approach him. He wants to be able to just run away and throw Ooh. grenades. The problem is that Ven might be able to push that against it between uh, Din's flame or Din's fire, just being able to blast it from across the stage and pop it in MVD's hands. Mm -hmm. Hasn't really been oh able to do God. it too much, though, because MVD is ready to fight. Dude, weirdly, his aerials have been amazing. Like, mixing up between throwing out Nair and also uh, using uh, down B2, staying out Z4 instead. But then also, back air has been so clean for him. All the aerials, man, he's using everything he needs to in order to stay alive here, Coney, in this loser's bracket. And ben not making it easy for him, but this is the biggest lead we've seen so far this set. It's just kind of what happens with uh, certain tiers of characters, too, where it feels, oh. like, it feels like at a certain point, you know, Zelda... Not a terrible character, but, you know, she's, she's lacking in a lot of ways, and it feels like as sets go on, it becomes easier and easier to exploit their flaws, especially against top players, and I think MVD has just sort of sniffed out Zelda's stuff. I mean, he's killing her earlier, getting the up tilts. He's not falling for the silly stuff. The Phantom has made really no impact at all this game. Yeah. It's just sort of a different vibe. Yeah, we can't see, you know, Ben again, too. We're seeing the neutral get up there, punished by the Nikita. And the MVD, two stock lead. Great adjustments being made by the Snake Man. What like, do you do at this point when you're behind uh, in Zelda? you got to approach, and well, that sucks. Yeah, that's the real problem, and that's why it was so clutch for Ven to get the initial stocks in those first two games. Right. Like, you could just see the difference in the tempo, the way that Ven does need to approach, come up with something. Look at that parry. Didn't get the sweet spot. That would have actually been super sick and maybe a way to make a comeback happen. But, again, not finding the sweet spot either time on those forward airs, man. Jab into down smash. I, I, oh, my God. <laughs> the conversions are so good from Ven, man. <laughs> Crazy. Oh, my goodness. Love just to in see a you, perfect dude. spot. Mm-hmm. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'll give it up. <laughs> I don't know what I'm giving it up for. Ben but. jumps into it, like, all right, cool, I'll sure. give it up. <laughs> Shakes his hand, like, all right, well played. It's a cool way to end a set. <laughs> yep. <laughs> like a Terminator movie. You just... Oh, my I God. Oh, my God. Oh, close. Here, take this back, man. Return to sender. Up air? Okay. Oh, my God. All right, we're, he's got kicks. Yeah. He can now do that, though. He's so far ahead. He can just sort of play around however he wants. He's got the Nikita Alvin forced to shield. <laughs> did the point you see that i did and there was nothing there i was yeah. like what is he pointing at jojo's character man you know it's point and it happens here we go forward smash trying to find something i love the fight from ben in the corner but it's just gonna be so tough to make this comeback against mvd max rage on zelda though i'm not gonna write anything off i mean you need i mean the miracle is zelda down air off stage right on Ooh. cypher 
Um, uh, back throw into a double jump read with a sweet spot right. forward air or something? I don't know, that's man. That's all I can figure. And maybe that's why Zen's hold, or Ven is holding the corner, hoping MVD comes over. But why would he have to? Just throw grenades. Yep. Like, he, Ven just doesn't want to lose. You know what I mean? That, oh, uh, okay. Bay right there. Only three minutes left on the clock, too, though. Oh, man. Maybe not bay right there for something. The grab would have done it, though. Guaranteed it. up tilt for sure. Yeah, it feels like Ven's, like, last gasp, right? Just oh. trying to force something to happen. Oh, my God. Getting around the down tilt. Ven is playing like he's... He realizes how dire this is. Yeah, this is amazing. Honestly, some of the best. Oh, there it goes. There it goes right there. C4. There's only so many chances you get against Snake before you run into a good hit. You know right. what I mean? At that point, Ven was playing incredible at that you know, 160, 170 mark. But Snake, <laughs> one thing we won't say about him is that he has a tough time killing. You know what I mean? Between right. up tilt, C4, especially MBD, uh, Nikita as well, Nair. Uh, I mean, he was hitting him with all the aerials, too. Forward so. tilt would have killed at that point, too. Yeah. I mean, like, it, well, if it connected, yeah. Yeah, grab. Yeah. I mean, there's just so much here. Had the C4 right there. I think Ven just uh, didn't really give it the consideration. Or maybe he just couldn't land and shield in time. Let me see. So he jumps up. I don't oh, think I don't he was ready think for he it. Yeah. He didn't even know. Yeah. Didn't pop shield or anything. So no. well done to MVD there going over on Ven. Uh, seemed very close at times. I mean, like it seemed like Ven really had his number. But again, I think just... That speaks to the character disparity sometimes, man. When Zelda has to approach, it is not a fun time. Nah, and I think this game is like, it's so balanced. You know what I mean? Like, there's so many things that are balanced about this game in terms of the tier list. Like, even a top tier versus like a mid tier feels very possible, especially depending on who the characters are. But the thing, too, is when, like you said, when Ben had to approach, that's when it really became a problem because the camping match was honestly kind of even. Like, right. it, like, Ben played it really, really well. In terms of din fires at the back of the shield, blowing up the grenades, uh, sending out the knight, like just the spacing on all that stuff was really, really good. Mixing up the timing of the projectile is so important too. So, and well played to Ben, but we got another great game three underneath our belts, Coney. It's We're been all game threes, dude. Yeah, it's been great, man. I it's mean, insane. That, that Ned Larry set that was that was hype, man. Was so many close games. I mean, yeah. everybody's trying to fight their way to the top, man. We've said it a million times before, but it really comes down. I mean, obviously, there's the the tournament prizing, right? Everybody wants to win the prizes, but those summit spots are so valuable yeah it's i mean we're all gonna be watching that summit of course so you know we always do you got to. it's some of the best content in the biz uh maybe the best content it's, it's definitely up there that's for sure easily easily so you guys already know what it is uh we're still here at main stage 2021 so guys make sure you stay tuned stay awake obviously i know usually i'm on the other side on the east coast so you guys gotta stay awake and stay energized that's why we have partnered here with mate mate uh Go, Coney, you can take the breathe. Yep, yep, Mate Mate. <laughs> in case you guys don't know, they're a natural energy drink made with Yerba Mate, and it's caffeine reimagined. You can click on the banner below or head to bts.gg slash Mate Mate. Enter the code BTS Smash to get 15% off on any order. And hey, guys, we got a photo contest too. So listen, what you guys got to do is post your most creative Mate Mate photo on Instagram. Use the hashtag Mate Mate Contest 21 and tag and follow at matemate.official. The winner will be determined live at main stage on Sunday. And the grand prize, Nintendo Switch. You can see it. It's going to end at 11 a.m. on November 14th. I you got to be at main stage. I think the reason why they have the clapping emoji there is because it's going to be determined by audience participation. Like, whoever's the Oh, you think so? Yeah, like, I, th I think that's what they said, right? I think that was on here at some point. Yeah. Con uh, let me see. Yeah, sure. Winner determined by live, live audience. audience. Yeah, there you go. There you go that's fun. That'll like be America a good time. Home videos. Or wait, or did Bob Saget just choose? I don't know. Either way. <laughs> Was it him? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he gets to decide <laughs> the winners every... Well, now... Did you know who hosts that show now? Who? Alfonso Ribeiro. Oh, oh, really? Yeah. I'll give it up. Isn't that weird? Oh, well, he used to. I don't know if he still does. All right. Well, speaking of hosting, we're going to give up our hosting duties. We're done for this block currently. Guys, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with more main stage right after this. Stick around. See you.